Hello dear ones, it's Alice. I am of the stars. Right here we have a pretty good geostorm shelter and it's also good as a newest newospheric shelter. It's a natural bowl in the mountains. I'll show you. Just all around, almost completely around it, uh, there are mountains, gentle mountains. And so what happens is from over, let's see, I think it's this way. You see there's a tall mountain. That's the bulk of LA over that way, I think. So the newospheric uh, thought forms, the energies of the newosphere, uh, swoop up the far side of the mountain over there, up into the sky, and over down this way towards the Pacific Ocean. And so when you're in this, in this natural bowl, like I am right now, it's exceedingly quiet and particularly missing are the the very rough vibes that come in in the city, the the aggressor victim paradigm and the uh, reptilian brain vibes are missing while I'm walking along this trail here that goes up the other side over there. I expect once I get back up this side and go back down, I'll be less sheltered from the newosphere. So this is a high rise above that newospheric bowl. And uh, there is the draw that, that lets water out of the bowl. And you can see that as it goes down this way, because the draw goes around in a kind of a curve, and then farther down there are taller mountains, and even taller mountains, so we have still a bowl, but an oddly shaped bowl at the um, part of the bowl that goes and lets water out down that way, where all the trees are. It looks to me like as the new spheric thought forms went up over, you can't see it, but there's a big mountain over there at the beginning of the bowl. And so LA is that way, I think. I might be wrong. But if it were that way, then they would, the thought forms would fly up into the air and come back down around here, most likely. Maybe another bounce or two along with the terrain, or like a wrinkle or warble in the newosphere, and then a bouncy ride on down that way, don't you think? There may be places down there that are geostorm and newospheric shelters as well. I have to show you some more about geo shelters and the newosphere. As I got priorly, I got the directions mixed up, and now I think I have them straight. Um, before I was saying that the way towards most of LA was a particular direction, and in fact that's the way towards the ocean. So let me show you with my revised estimates what I have. Okay, here we have my shadow, and according to my Girl Scout training, that ought to be at this time of day in the afternoon. My shadow should be casting to the east, and east is the way towards Los Angeles, the majority of Los Angeles. So here we have a high mountain here, higher than where I'm standing, and another mountain trail that I just came down and pretty good rise of land. There is the sun, which is, according to my estimation, must be over towards the west right now. So over here we have north. North might be a good direction for a lot of people, and there's quite a mountain there. And the newosphere is completely silent right here. It's, it's incredible. It's revitalizing. It's, it's a really good spot. So what we have here that's working so incredibly well, it's a fold that heads north and south and has ridges to the east and to the west. It's working better than the bowl. Yeah as in prior trials. You know, if you were to compare um, newospheric thought form movement to that of sound waves, you could get an idea why a bowl of land might not be as good as a wrinkle of land. Um, because 
sound in a bowl tends to reverberate around. A, a bowl makes a good sound theater. And so it's possible that thought forms also get caught in a large bowl like the first that I showed and uh, may not be able to get out so well. Whereas in a wrinkle, like the north-south wrinkle with the east and western ridges, uh, the thought forms have a chance to leap up in the air, high up and over to the other side. That's what I think. <laughs>